Hey guys, Styled Sneal here. I'm going to be ranking every single holdable cosmetic in Gorilla Tag. Now you may be asking yourself, Styled Sneal, how are you going to do this? Well first, if you subscribe, I'll tell you. <coughs> so if I head into City here, you're going to see something a little, let's uh, say, unusual. That's right, we have a tier list maker in Gorilla Tag. Alright, so a few things before we begin. I do not have both variations of non-gold and gold because I'm not going to count them as separate. I'll just count the cosmetic as itself just because it makes it easier and I can only hold 30 things on this little tier list here. But you can see, holdables. So, uh, I guess we'll start here. The Big Monkey Candy Bar. I think this one is, I'd have to say B. You, you can't eat it, which kind of sucks, but it is huge as well, so it kind of can get in the way. Which does bring up the small one. It's out of the way. You can make the same jokes other than the fact that it's not open and it's, it's not having a bite taken out of it. So I'll make that A tier. And I suppose we should have a baseline. What should be our baseline cosmetic? Sparkler. Sparkler is good for a base. It's an old one, it's an old but a good. It has a sound effect that can get annoying, but you can turn it off and it's a classic, so yeah. Next, candy cane. It's a food that you can't eat because it came out before you could eat, so you have to give it a pass for that. But I think in general, it's good for the theme of Christmas on there, but I haven't seen anyone actually using it in a long time. So I'm gonna put this in the E tier. It's just a peppermint stick that's been curved. All right, this one, the clover. So the four leaf clover, it's a small holdable, so it doesn't get in the way, but although it's small, you kind of can't tell that you're holding it, which does kind of suck. Uh, holdable, I think, should be a bigger type of thing, something like, if you're gonna go for it, something more noticeable like the roses. So I'll put these in E tier, and that goes for both the regular and the gold clover. Yes, we have the Star Princess Wand. So Princess Wand, people have said is awesome, but I think otherwise. I think it's overrated. You what? And I think uh, just to make some people mad, uh, it's gonna go in uh, the F tier as the worst cosmetic so far. Another thing to note is a lot of the like behind the back cosmetics aren't in here. Uh, I can see the, the pan and the ladle. But like, this isn't on there because I had to make some cuts and limitations, especially with like the gold versus non-gold. Then we have the pie, the edible pie. Edible food always gets a pass from me. I think them adding that was actually awesome. Uh, pie is pretty good and it's blueberry, which is one of my favorite flavors for a type of pie. That's so gonna get an A tier from me. All right, the corn, since we're on some food. I don't think when you eat it, it looks that good. I think it's just uh, a limitation because corn would be a lot more 3D with a lot more depth of more individual kernels, which you can't really get. But the popcorn is pretty good that you can make with the fire. So I'll give it a B tier. I do have both candy apples here because they do matter. So the only difference is one's caramel and one's the candy apple. So the thing is, I used to have braces and I, would not be able to have either of these. So I was always having the, the tough decision of which one I would not be able to eat, which was always both of them, but I had to, you know, make a decision whenever there was one around that I wanted. And I would always pick the caramel. Caramel gets an A tier. Caramel is, is pretty great. Candy apples, I'm not a fan. I'll give that a D. The first D tier. All right, next one, icicle. You can stab people with it. This was a classic from back in the day of styled snail. This gets an S tier. I would still use that today. The golden electric guitar, pretty good. The guitars were pretty good, although really annoying. They kind of died out pretty fast, but the guitars were the most long lasting out of all of the uh, instrument cosmetics. So I'll put this at C tier. That might be the highest one that goes up there for instruments. Cause the only other one we have here that's a holdable is the acoustic guitar. And I gotta say the electric guitar sounds a lot better to me than the acoustic one. Although I do like acoustic guitar as well. I just also like some of that rock and roll. All right, next, the roses. All of the roses together. Uh, 
which is the only change is color. I would give these, they're pretty noticeable and they're not too in the way. I'd give these, I'd give these an, actually not, no, I'll give them a, a B. B's a pretty good spot for those. They came out on Valentine's Day, so a little biased because uh, that's my birthday. We have the turkey, the turkey holdable. Let's see, you know what, that, that goes along with the duck, so let's get the duck as well. What one should go where? The duck came out first. The turkey sounds funnier and also kind of has the duck squeak as well. I think duck might still beat it just because it's a classic, but these ones are, are true classics. So that they still get high placements. All right, this one, people are not gonna like. Regular turkey leg versus the new turkey leg that you can eat. I've never really particularly enjoyed this one. Although I get that people like the old school kind of low poly pixelated look about it. I'm gonna give regular turkey leg C tier and give this new turkey leg an A tier. A tier edible cosmetic. And we have the bubble gun, another classic, one that I love. And we haven't had anything else bubble gun-ish or even something that kind of leaves a trail like that other than this, the bubble gun is just so much better. Then we have the ladle and pan, useless without each other because they can make the sound. But to be honest, I'm not a fan of either of them because you can't make the sound with anything else. So I'm gonna give these both an E tier. Not a fan, they could have been household cosmetics. And speaking of household cosmetics, we have the, the wrenches, both the gold and non-gold wrench. I think the wrench is uh, I'd give it a, a D tier. I wasn't a fan of the, the household cosmetics, but these ones, the fork knife, funny joke, I, I, right? You have to give it at least a little bit higher for that, and it is two cosmetics, so I'll give it two up. Give it B. And then we have the branches, both the regular and silver branches. The branches are awesome. Even when you're holding them, they're not way too noticeable because they're thin. These were an old classic of mine, and they get an S tier. Although, when you have reshade and bloom, the regular one looked way better than the silver one. We have the popsicle. This is also another classic. I got this when it came out, along with a lot of cosmetics, but uh, this was one of my favorite ones that I had on for a while. Another classic that gets an S. And we have the mod stick. Mod stick gets an F. Nice. I'm just kidding, they get S rank. Don't ban me. Please. There we go. And the last holdable is the cranberry can. Kind of weird. And to be honest, this one's not going to get a high rating because it kind of makes no sense. Why is it floating out unless we're underwater? We haven't been shown anything that shows that we are underwater. We're just kind of, we're just kind of just expected to believe it's just kind of floating. Which doesn't particularly make sense, although I get it with what they were doing with the the weird mesh deformation or vertex offsets or something. I don't know how they made it, but something with a shader probably. I'll give it a D tier. Because even though it's not particularly something that makes sense, it is pretty funny. But that's the end of this tier list. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you think about all of these controversial opinions. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, join the Discord down below. Tier list mod by dev, link in the description. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.